Hey there, my lovely, lovely Libras, cross watchers and channel fans. How are you? It is Lori and I'm coming to you from outdoors today. Yes, I'm going to do your daily reading for you. Whatever comes out, comes out. I hope that you guys are all happy, healthy, and having some fun. Let's roll the zodiac die to see what signs you might be dealing with, Libra. There you are, down on the bottom here, whoop whoop. You also have Scorpio, Cancer, Aquarius, Gemini, and Pisces. All right, it is windy, so I hope my cards do not blow away. I appreciate your patience as I deal with no internet. <clears throat> so I have to sit for hours at um, a business like Panera or whatever to upload your readings. And uh, yeah, nothing at the house for at least a day or two. All right, your overall energy here is the Knight of Pentacles, okay? You're taking your time. I'm hearing something may have just been offered to you and you're not quite sure what you want to do with this. Yeah, this could be a quite, quite an offer here, but you're not sure how you feel about this. Let's go ahead and see what Spirit wants you to know about this situation. Spirit, what would you like to tell our lovely, lovely Libras, Cross Watchers, and Channel fans today about this particular message? What is coming at them and what would, do they need to know? Take a chance on this. It will be really good for you. It will lighten your heart. It will lighten your load. You will feel younger. You will feel more carefree. This is somebody offering help for most of you. This is somebody offering some sort of assistance, fun, uh, money, whatever it is. It may feel like it's too good to be true. Make sure you're doing your homework and finding out what the details are. But it does look like it will be very, very good for you. Okay, somebody really wants to do something nice here. They see that you may be living with regrets, um, a loss, or something else. Let's go ahead and see what else Spirit wants you to know about this situation here. Okay, it could be from somebody from your past coming back in. This could be a family member. It could be a friend that you've had for a long time. It could be romantic for a couple of you, but it feels because of the pentacles there, more like somebody wants to do something nice. They've got their heart in the right place here. And this could be somebody you've known for quite a long time. All right, let's go ahead and see what Spirit thinks your best efforts to focus on. Where would your focus be best? Where would your efforts best be focused? Let's see what we can find out here for you. <clears throat> We've got the Queen of Wands and the... No? Okay. Spirit's telling me I dropped it. Let's see what we've got here. Whoop, that one came out. Okay. Eight of Cups. Leaving something behind. Not worrying. Lighten the load is what I'm hearing. Allow yourself to be lightened. Okay? Um, taken care of. Let other people help you. Don't try to do something all on your own here. See, work with others and it will help you to change your life, change direction of where you're at. <clears throat> oh, I see a crab claw on the ground. <laughs> Just looked down to get the ant off my leg. And there's a crab claw down there. <clears throat> All right. Let us see what's going on with your relationships. Any type of relationship that you have. It could be um, friends, family, pets, co-workers. Is there anything that you need to know? Look at that. Happy times. Three of cups and the nine of cups here. Everything's really good. Take some time to have some fun is what Spirit's saying. All right. Really take some time and have some fun in life. Get out there and enjoy yourself. You've definitely been going through something because other people around you are recognizing it and want to step in to help you, okay? They want to help you. They want to do what they can to bring you some sort of peace, joy. 
all right? And you will feel very happy you did this, that you made the choice to get out there, okay? With that Nine of Cups, go have some fun. Go have some fun. This is double Nine of Cups here. Look at that, Six of Cups and Three of Cups. And then you got the Nine of Cups here. And you got cups all the way across the board. See, somebody from the past wants to help you leave something behind and celebrate the future, what's coming in. Lighten up, okay, is what I'm hearing. Not, not in a bad way, like help you to lighten up, okay, to enjoy life again. Money, nothing really growing very quickly, but it's growing, it's stable. You have nothing to worry about. Yeah. Okay, so there's really nothing for you to worry about here. With your money, look at this. You've got the Page of Pentacles, the Ten of Cups, and the Wheel of Fortune here as far as your money goes. So even though things are not growing very quickly right now, they are growing. Things are going well. Um, and your, your destiny is about to change. You know, this is going in the right direction is what I keep hearing. All right. So things are growing. Sorry, the wind, as you can probably tell, just picked up like crazy. Also, it's beautiful out here right now. I'll tell you what, it feels like it's 70 degrees. I know it's much warmer than that. In fact, I don't know if I can even find out what the temperature is because I'm not connected to the internet here. It's 80 degrees, okay? But it feels beautiful with that breeze and uh, very low humidity right now. All right, let's see. So the guy gets in his car, puts his sunscreen up so I can't see him. <sighs> Running his car. I appreciate people. I do. Let's see what your outcome is here. Seven of Wands and Seven of Swords, double seven. Something really good is coming your way as long as you remember to not um, cave if somebody demands something of you. Somebody made, like... You have to have some sort of plan here, but I am hearing somebody may come forward and say, hey, you know, let's, you need to do this. If anyone uses the words must, should, have to, need to, if you hear any of those words out of anybody's mouth, you need to uh, slow down and get a, a plan. Really look at what they're suggesting because that's not for you. Okay, that will keep you. You've got to maintain your own balance, your own equilibrium here. And you got the Ace of Pentacles. So this is, yeah, look at this. You're, look at that. Four of Wands. Do not give up, is what I'm hearing, because you're about to hear something else that's better for you at the end of your, your day here, at the end of the situation, whatever it is. Okay, whatever it is, it's going to be good. Let's see what we've got here. You will be receiving some sort of information here. It's something unexpected, too. All right. It's going to be creative and imaginative. All right, my lovely, lovely Libras, Cross Watchers, Channel fans. Oh, I'm going to get you one uh, message here. Let's see what Spirit has for you. What does Spirit have for you? So this is a good reading. If you're interested in a personal reading, please reach out to me. Email me, and I will send you all the information. If you're interested in donating to the channel, go to my channel. Go to the About page, and there's all kinds of links in there for all kinds of stuff, actually. If you've never checked out somebody's About, or, yeah, their About page on their channel, please consider doing so. You'll learn a lot more about the person who's got the channel. Sanctuary, you are divinely guided gently and lovingly. So whatever the situation is, you definitely have somebody, someone wanting to protect you here. Okay. Let's see what else we've got going on here. You've got a safe place, a safe haven. Somebody is looking out for you, whether it's divine or it's somebody here that you've known for your whole life. Okay, you are inspired. You are receiving divine inspiration by the end of this. That's what that page of cups is. Okay, and it gives you focus, a new focus with that page of wands. You're going to learn something new there, that, that's for sure. There will be an element of learning something new. Let's see what Sanctuary has. 
for you. All right, so go within and find your inner refuge. Be a haven for others and let others be one for you. Step forward with grace, deliberation, and thoughtfulness. Take moments for re reflection. Your soul wants you to know that it's in times of retreat and inner sanctuary that you can truly hear the voice of your soul. Create a place of beauty in your home or get outside in nature, but go to a place where you can carefully listen to your inner voice. You may have been pushing too hard or struggling to keep going. This is a time to be still and nurture your internal world. Connect with your higher power and those around you. Draw nourishment from the wellspring that's inside of you, your higher power. All right, think carefully about decisions you make at this time. Remember, Spirit said you need a strategy, a plan here with the Seven of Swords. All right, and proceed with care and deliberation. Retreat. Reflect on your heart's true desires and access your divine guidance and the divine inspiration. All right, my lovely, lovely Libras, cross watchers, channel fans, until our energy crosses again, I'm wishing you much peace, love, and happiness. Bye bye.